my daughter so long? Is the content the lieutenant crafts real? Or a grand illusion? Is he a man simply playing the hero like an instrument? Orchestrating a symphony of lies? Is it real? Or is it all one big hoax? Today that question will be answered. For today, is the judgment of Lieutenant Lickme. I've thought about how I would say this for a long time, but whatever way it's packaged, whatever way it's spun, it doesn't matter. Because it's the inconvenient, destructive truth. The truth is, some videos have been real. Some videos, most videos, have been fake. Now, to some of you, this may not be a surprise as some videos were made to be abundantly clear that they are fake, primarily to keep YouTube's unrelenting terms of service off my tail, while other videos were crafted with stringent effort to appear deceptively real. But today, I am deciding to expose myself for I would rather die in truth than thrive any longer in a lie. The future of this channel will be decided by you today, and we revealed how at the end. You're probably wondering why I am choosing to reveal this now. Why would I reveal this when the channel has just come back and everything's going well, not to mention the release of the Battle Pass and having a new face for this channel? All to just show my face again. It's because it's the hardest thing to do right now. All of you have supported me completely, and I cannot allow you to believe in a lie anymore. I'm not going to let you buy into something that isn't true. So, today is about those who believed in me and this channel. To the viewers, to my friends and to my family. I want you all to be proud of not just what I achieved or the content that I make, but more so who I am as a person and what I stand for. So this is a part of the painful process to become a better person, not just for you, but for me as well. Now, to those of you who found some kind of hope here, maybe a place to feel safe, to my viewers, I'm sorry I let you down. You'll deserve the truth, and I'm just sorry it took me this long to tell you. I'm sorry I let you believe in something that wasn't real. I'm sorry you might feel you've been betrayed, or maybe you feel stupid for believing something like this was real and defending it. And I'm sorry to see you go if you no longer want to support this channel. But I completely understand. I'm sorry to those of you who are creators in the space I put myself in. I labeled what I made as trolling and made my content that was manufactured and manipulated as a competitor to yours. And I'm sorry if you felt frustrated watching me grow through this scripted form of content. I know that must have been aggravating and it was not fair. Now, 
There are many things I'm here to apologize for, but there are also some things I will not apologize for. I will not apologize to those of you who tried to drag my channel into the dirt. Those who made up lies about me or this channel. I have deceived people and I will own that, but I am not a bad human. Unfortunately, you can only know who I am based on these small fragments of myself that I put on the internet. It's not your fault you don't know me, but please do not assume things about me or make up things that I have done. I will not apologize to those who put exposed videos out hoping to hook my viewers in. Not because you wanted to defame me, not because you wanted my channel to be torn apart, but because you simply sought to destroy what others enjoy. You could not allow them to have something to find hope in. And that's heartless. So to those of you who salivated over the thought of ending this channel and ruining the experience I could provide for my viewers, to those of you that are happy now that I'm exposing myself and bringing this shit to its knees, just remember, it brings me immense satisfaction that I am the one to bring this channel to its knees, not you. Because you never own my victories and I will make damn sure you don't own my losses. And lastly, I will not apologize to those of you who the videos gave some kind of hope to in a dark time. I will not apologize if the videos gave you a laugh and a sad one or maybe a sense of closure when you needed it the most. I know that they weren't real but they did carry some kind of impact for some people and I won't apologize for that. And that's why I let my morals swarm and just fight each other inside my head for so long. It was no longer just about how I felt carrying this lie but how others felt when watching the videos and how they would feel knowing the truth. Some kind of internet do-gooder was really a liar who just packaged and sold justice as some kind of cheap street food on the corner. And yet, I had emails from people saying this channel's message kept them breathing. That they had been abused their entire life and knowing other victims of abuse were gaining this closure and peace, it indirectly gave them theirs. Or maybe it's just not that deep. Maybe it's simply entertainment. But that weight from those few? I just felt like, how dare I take that hope from them? Or just so I can feel okay and I can clear my conscience. But it's been a long time and that weight has taken its toll on me. And I'm sorry, but I can't take that anymore. In reality, I am just a guy who wanted to make creative things and saw an opportunity to hopefully inspire some people to do a bit of good in this world, but that's it. I'm not a hero. I'm overwhelmingly average. Maybe that's the point. I am average. And although I don't encourage any of you to do what I did, I do think the average person has a lot more power to create change than they realize. And I hope in a small way, I could be some twisted example of that. Or maybe this video stands as a simple reminder to just speak the truth, no matter the cost. Now, I want to thank you all. You all helped build something that was actually special and true. You connected with this idea I had a long time ago to stand for others and fear none. This mantra is not some see-through bullshit marketing tactic. It's the one truth that appeared from the smoke and mirrors that is my content. It's that small, subtle shift in the way you think, but one that lasts on people. One that sits with you and hopefully makes you a better person. One that fills you with a little more courage to do just a little more good. Even though I was not real, the belief in what I did, your belief, created something tangible so that there might be some shred of value in what I did so that you would know that even if your heroes in life turn out to be fake and everything feels like it's bullshit the heroes that they allowed you to become through them was real now what happens from here well you will have a choice if you want the channel to continue it will be left up to a vote and whatever the outcome I will accept your judgment because None of this continues without you. So I will either step down or I will continue to create for you, to create for me. This vote is very simple, almost insultingly simple. Like the video if you want the channel to continue. Alternatively, just like the video if you wish for the channel to end here, if you feel you can no longer support what this channel truly is. And for those of you who supported me by becoming paid members, I understand you may wish to revoke your membership, but just know any physical rewards that you are owed from months past will be shipped to you to the best of my ability. The Battle Pass will be serving its final reward this month, and then coming to a close until the decision is made. 
But whatever happens, guys, all of you, please remember, you were and always will be the real change. Not the videos, but that they continue or not, you are that change and you are the thing that I've grown to be most proud of. Not the achievements or the money or any kind of tacky bullshit internet fame. It's you and it's always been you. So please, if you abandon me in this channel, I wholeheartedly understand, but please hold anything you have gained from this channel, anything you have learned or the impact it's had on you, hold it with you in your life. Look at this guy starting to tear up. Jesus Christ, get it together, buddy. Anyway, the voting ends in one week from today, and then the decision will be made. If we continue, you will not see me again. Lieutenant like me will become what it needs to be. And that is not a person, not a face, but an idea. But if this is where it ends, this will be the last time you hear from me. And just know, no matter what, it's been my absolute honor to entertain you. But my greatest regret to ever deceive you. So it's time for me to face the music. Farewell, my friends, and please. Say bye to your mom for me.